Good morning to all of my ladybug friends at Smith Street and at Nelson Street. Teacher Cassie is here to do a little music and moving. And I have a special book for us to read today. So I'm so happy that even though we're in different places, we still get to have our class together every week until we get to be back in the same place all together. So friends, some of my friends at Nelson Street do a little yoga with me. So we're going to start by warming our bodies up today. And I know that my friends at Smith Street know some of these moves too, okay? So I'm going to go back here and sit down on my yoga mat and I'm going to sit in my crisscross yoga sauce and I'm going to reach out and get so big and so little and I'll get so big and so little and one more time I'm going to get so big and I'll clap my hands over my head pull my hands down in front of me zoom and I could rub those hands together and I'll say rub 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 rub, rub stop Rub 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 stop. Rub 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 stop. And now I'll take those hands and I'll put them on my head, boop, and my cheeks. And I can go. Let me get a little closer for that. It's pretty silly. I know some friends like that. I go. I could take a deep breath in and say. Or I could stick out my tongue. And... Now grownups, that might all seem a little bit silly but moving the muscles in our mouths, with our lips and our cheeks and our jaw helps with language development, okay? So we're exercising those muscles we need to be able to communicate with each other. So now I'm going to come and sit back down and I could turn into a silly ah, gorilla on my chest. I could rub my belly and cut down my legs till I find my quiet toes. Shh. And then I can say, wake up toes. Boop. And I could stomp, 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 my friend Chicken Nugget. She's a little chihuahua. She's joining our class today. Can you say hi Chicken Nugget? Oh she's very she's a very good student. She likes to be in class with us so she might be in and out a little bit. Right Chicky? All right let's get those stomping feet back out. Ready? I can say stop 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 realistic. This is like what class is actually like with the kids. <laughs> and I can sit back in my crisscross yoga sauce and I could reach out and get so big 
and clap my hands over my head. Pull my hands down in front of me. Zoom. And now, friends, we're going to chant our OM sound together. I'll take a deep breath in and say, OM. And now we're ready for our OM chant. I could rub my hands and sing, Rub your hands, sit up tall, take a deep breath. Oh. And I'll take my hands and put them behind me and lift up my feet. And I can say, rub your feet, sit up tall, take a deep breath. And now it can get very tricky with our ultimate challenge. I can try to rub my feet and my hands at the same time. And I'll sing, rub your hands and your feet, sit up tall, take a deep breath. Now, I want to do a little moving and singing hello. So I have my good friend Billy here with us again today. Can you wave and say, hi, Billy. <gasps> Billy says, hello, everyone. Now, we're going to do a little moving and singing hello together. So, I want to pull something up real quick for myself. And you can just listen to the way we're going to move, and then you'll be able to move and sing with me. And we'll start with a little clap. We'll clap, we'll clap our hands. Here we go.
rest quietly together. Hi there, let's rest hello. Hi there, let's rest hello. Shh. Wake up everybody! are really helpful for impulse control and practicing self-regulation, okay? We're actually practicing doing one thing and then having to stop in the middle of it, okay? So this is a good thing to practice a couple of times a day, especially when we're not able to get outside as much as we usually like to. So, friends, can you show me how you walk? for doing some moving and stopping with me. Now friends, Billy's going to take just a little rest, okay? So we can say, bye-bye, Billy. I'll just 
be waiting over here till it's time for him to come back again. And now friends, I have a special book to read today. Okay, we might have to make some adjustments for seeing the pictures. So this book is called, I Ain't Gonna Paint No More. So we're going to get to look at some colors and some parts of our body with this book and with our next couple of songs. So I want to get out a scarf for myself. Okay. Today, it's going to be a beautiful red scarf. Maybe you have a scarf at home, okay? or a special blankie, or even a loofah or a washcloth. And we're going to pretend that this scarf is our paint brush, okay? So this is our book. I ain't gonna paint no more. Getting a little closer to everyone. All right. Oh, and this book is fun because I sing it, so. Don't worry, we'll get the full treatment. Oh, look at all those amazing colors on that page. This book is by Karen Beaumont and illustrated by David Catro. Let's see here. Okay. One day my mama caught me painting pictures on the floor. And the ceilings and the walls and the curtains and the door. And I heard my mama holler like I never heard before. Ya ain't a gonna paint no more. Uh oh. There they are in that bathtub. I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. There's Mama putting that paint up high in the closet. Let's see what happens. <gasps> That's what I say, but there ain't no way that I ain't gonna paint no more. Oh, the paint's coming back out. So I take some red. And I paint my head. Friends, can you paint your head red? Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Ah, uh, what the heck gonna paint my neck? Where's your neck? Here's my neck right here. I'm gonna paint that up. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. There we go. Still I just can't rest till I paint my chest. Ooh, a nice swirly on that chest. Can you paint your chest? Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Guess there ain't no harm if I paint my Oh, arm. Oh, very cool. Can we paint our arms with our paintbrushes? Choo, choo, choo. Choo, 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 choo. And now I ain't gonna paint no more. I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. But I just can't stand not to paint my hand. Look at that silly face on that hand. Can you paint your hands? We could do a little good work. And now I ain't gonna paint no more. Then I see some black, so I paint my back. Oh, got that roller out. Can you reach around? We could go up and over to paint our backs. We could go under and around. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Like an Easter egg, gonna paint my leg. Let's get our legs now. I'm gonna put 
One leg up here. And another leg up here. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Still I ain't complete till I paint my feet. Oh, look at those wacky feet. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Can you get your brush out and we'll paint our feet? Ready? What's left to paint? I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. But I'm such a not gonna paint my... <gasps> what? Uh-oh. There's Mama. And she sees what's happened in the house. Y'all don't faint. Cause there ain't no paint. So I ain't gonna paint no more. The end. All right, friends. Isn't that a fun book? I absolutely love the illustrations and that we can sing it while we read it. So now I just wanna look at colors with all of you for a moment. And if I take my fingers and I wiggle them on my chin just like this. This is the sign for colors. Colors, okay? So I have some handy dandy scarves. You already saw my beautiful red scarf. But I have quite a few more over here. So I have my red scarf that can say, Wee! And what's next? Orange. My orange scarf can say, Wee! And next I have my yellow scarf. Yellow goes, I have green. My green scarf goes wee. And oh, it's so beautiful. My beautiful blue scarf goes wee. And last, I have my beautiful purple scarf and it goes wee. And now friends, we'll have a little color explosion. Everybody ready? One, two, three, wee. Good work everyone. Now we have one more song to sing before we sing goodbye. And this is one of my favorite songs. It's called what color do you like? My favorite colors are teal and red and indigo. And I like sparkly gold too. So it's fun to kind of find out what all of our friends' favorite colors are. So I'm gonna bring my little bench back here to sit on. And I gotta get Billy from over here. And we can listen for the names of our favorite colors together.
for doing some moving and singing and story time with me today. I hope that you all have a wonderful rest of your day. So now we're going to be ready to do a little singing goodbye, okay? So grown-ups, in case you're interested, I also have a Facebook page, um, at Shindigs NYC, um, that has some videos up already. And every Tuesday morning, I'm doing a donation class at 11 um, on Facebook Live, and it will also be streaming to my YouTube channel at the same time. So Tuesdays from 11 to about 11.40. And then on Thursdays, I'm doing a class uh, hosted by the Brooklyn Public Library. So that's a free class for the patrons, okay? And that class is from 10 to 10.40 on Thursdays. You could watch through my Shindigs page or through any of the BPL, Brooklyn Public Library, or Brooklyn Public Library Family Facebook pages, okay? So lots of different ways we can get back together. So now friends, can you show me how you wave goodbye?